everyone, 2020 is finally here and I'm sure all of you are as excited as I am. New year, new beginnings and new year resolutions. I'm sure most of you would have already started preparing your list. But say batana, how many of you were able to complete this list that you made last year? Today, I have decided that I will share with you some important resolution that you must take for this next year. This is something that I did back in 2011 when I was fresh out of college and started my first job. And uh, actually those resolutions helped me get my first uh, car, my first house and my first foreign trip all before I turned 30. And I'm sure if you also follow these resolutions, you will also be able to do the same. So the first resolution would be ensure that you're watching your expenses. Your expenses or your monthly expenses should never be more than how much you're earning. Uh, and if it is a state like that, if you're in a state where you're where spending more than what you're earning, that's a really bad place to be in. Go back and look at where you're spending and maybe you need to cut down on some of it. The second resolution would be start saving and start small. What I mean by this is whatever you're earning currently, be it 50,000 a month or lakh a month or 1.5 lakh a month, whatever this amount is, ensure that you're constantly, you're regularly saving some amount of that money uh, and this amount need not be a big amount. You can start with something as small as 500 a month. Uh, what I would recommend is start saving or investing at least 10% of your in-hand salary that you get every month. And uh, the way to do that would be first, whatever money you get, ensure that you are investing 10% of that money and then only start to look at other expenses. There are multiple instruments in the market for, the, for this. If you're new in the market, if you're new, uh, new, new in the job, if you don't know much about stock markets, don't go for stock markets. You can look at something like a PPF, you can look at uh, mutual funds, you can look at index funds, which uh, even Warren Buffett recommended to many instruments will give you a fairly good return at a less risk. Third and the most important resolution of this year would be start investing in yourself. What I mean by that is whatever you like, let's say you like cooking, let's say you like uh, reading books, whatever it may be, please start investing in yourself. Maybe you can take a new course, maybe you can decide to uh, read a new book. And the fourth resolution would be emergency funds. Ensure that at any point of time, you're having at least three to six months of emergency fund in your account, which you can use in case of emergencies. Life is unpredictable, right? And uh, or maybe sometime you just want to take a break. So in any of these situations, you should have some financial backing with you. And here, if you are somebody who has dependence on them, maybe uh, your wife or your kids or your parents, uh, in that case, ensure that you are also protecting them financially. You can look at something like a life insurance or a health insurance for you and your family. Uh, so that's pretty much that I had for today. To summarize it all, first, watch out for your expenses. Ensure that you're not spending more than what you're earning. Second, start investing and start small. Don't go overboard. Third would be start investing in yourself. Constantly upgrade yourself. Fourth would be emergency funds. Ensure that you are protecting yourself and your family for future. That's pretty much from my side. Happy New Year and happy investments. Guys, if you liked it, please like and share it. Thank you.